Let's fill out our function from the inside out and graph 20x minus x squared. This is a downward opening parabola, intersects the x-axis at 0 and 20, and it has its vertex here at 10, 100. If g of x is 20 times the absolute value of x minus x squared, then it looks the same to the left and to the right of the y-axis. So g will look something like this. Let's let h be the absolute value of the previous function. The absolute value means it's going to bounce up and off of the x-axis. So our be equation becomes the absolute value of h of x minus c is equal to 21, and this has 12 solutions. We notice that when h of x is between 0 and 100, it has 6 solutions. From our absolute value, we have h of x is equal to c plus 21, or h of x is equal to c minus 21. Let's substitute. Let's combine our chain inequalities and solve for c. So c consists of integers between 21 and 79. This gives us 57 solutions for c.